What is the fuel pump and what does it do? Before going into the specifics of bad fuel pump symptoms, it's critical to comprehend the fuel pump's significance in your car and its primary function. The fuel pump, as its name suggests, is in charge of transferring fuel from the fuel tank to the entire fuel system. Depending on your vehicle, this pump may operate using electrical or mechanical force. The fuel is distributed to all other parts, including the fuel injectors and the cylinders. After it is pumped from the fuel tank, the fuel pump is expected to wear out over time of use, so you'll need to replace it eventually. Failure to replace the fuel pump has many negative effects that affect the performance of your vehicle as a whole. As a result, you must change the fuel pump as soon as it breaks or even before it does. Ten bad fuel pump symptoms. You should keep an eye out for any bad fuel pump symptoms because the fuel pump is a crucial part of your car. The good news is that your car will let you know if the fuel pump is failing or about to fail through some symptoms. Let's examine some of the typical signs of a bad fuel pump in more detail. Power loss. You'll experience power loss because the engine is constantly stressed, especially if the fuel pump is extremely damaged. Don't be shocked if you have to deal with an engine stalling or abrupt stop when that occurs. Car overheating. One of your vehicle's worst enemies is overheating because it quickly causes serious breakdown. For instance, if you are driving your car and notice that the temperature gauge is significantly rising, it may be a sign that the fuel pump is malfunctioning. Remember that a variety of possible causes could be involved in a car overheating incident. As a result, you can't just assume that it's the fuel pump. Instead, you need to conduct a thorough inspection to identify the true culprit. Engine sputtering. Have you ever been driving your car and noticed the engine sputtering, especially if you're maintaining a high speed while doing so? If that occurs, it is obvious that your fuel pump is failing, and you should replace it as soon as possible. When the engine struggles to maintain a steady state fuel supply to the engine at high speeds, it alerts you to the problem. As a result, the engine won't produce the steady state energy needed to keep operating your car efficiently. Problematic fuel pressure gauge. Since the fuel pressure gauge serves as your primary means of determining how much fuel is still in the tank, it's possible that it will display odd readings when the fuel pump is malfunctioning. Because the pump is not supplying the engine with enough fuel, the gauge will become confused, which is why occasionally the gauge will read very high before abruptly dropping sharply and without warning. Vehicle not starting at all. You can't start the car in some dire situations and when the fuel pump isn't functioning. What would happen if the fuel, the engine's primary source of power, was not delivered? It will be very similar to driving your car completely out of gas. Therefore, you must watch for early symptoms that the fuel pump is failing before it gets to this point. Low fuel economy. Expect subpar fuel economy if your fuel pump isn't functioning correctly. Your engine constantly anticipates a certain amount of fuel supply. You'll notice that you're stopping at the gas station more frequently than usual when the engine doesn't receive this amount because it will need more fuel. Remember that in addition to your vehicle's fuel system and other components, low fuel economy can be caused by any number of other factors. As a result, a thorough inspection is required to determine whether the problem is being caused by a bad fuel pump. Engine surges. Another crucial sign that the fuel pump is failing is sudden engine surges. The fuel pump is not functioning properly, and it may send more fuel into the engine than is necessary to keep it running at normal speeds. So, when the engine surges while driving at normal speeds, the fuel pump needs to be checked. Difficulty starting. You may not necessarily experience any starting issues at all if the fuel pump is not completely failing, but you will experience problems starting the car between now and then. In other words, you should check the fuel pump because it might be the problem if you notice that sometimes you can start the car but other times you can't 10 engine. Fuel tank whining. As a general rule, you should take this problem seriously whenever you hear any noise coming from the vehicle, whether it is loud or not and is connected to the fuel tank. These noises could be your car's way of getting your attention so that you can fix small problems before they become major ones. Like any other component, a malfunctioning fuel pump may cause whining noises to emanate from the fuel tank. This is an indication that the fuel pump is attempting to draw fuel from the fuel tank and send it to the engine, but something is going wrong. You must speak with your mechanic to fix the issue if you become alarmed by these noises. Engine overheating. Finally, don't be surprised if you have to deal with engine overheating if the engine is constantly under pressure. And one of the last things any driver would want to deal with is overheating. This overheating can quickly cause serious engine damage that could quickly cost thousands of dollars. Therefore, you must pull over and stop your car as soon as you notice that the temperature gauge is reading very high. Before opening the hood and inspecting the engine, 
experts advise waiting at least 15 minutes for your car to cool off. In the event that you discover that this was ineffective, you must speak with a mechanic before attempting to start the car with tools because you risk dealing with engine damage very quickly. How much does it cost to replace a bad fuel pump? Fuel pump replacement costs range from $220 to $1,000. Yes, replacement fuel pumps can be very expensive, especially if you drive a luxury vehicle. Therefore, you must assess the entire situation and determine that your vehicle is worth the investment before spending a penny on listing the field pump. If not, you might want to think about selling your car and using the proceeds to pay for a better car. How often should I replace the fuel pump? Every 100,000 miles. Of course, you'll replace it before you reach 100,000 miles if you notice any of the typical symptom that the fuel pump is failing. Similar to this, it is advised that you be proactive with your car if you reach 100,000 miles and install the fuel pump just in case and before it breaks. 